Hello family and friends. Welcome in. Welcome in Gemini. This message is going to be for all Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, the North Node. And we're going to also pull from your ruling planet Mercury. Gemini, excuse my voice guys. I am feeling a little bit under the weather. Alright, but I feel a little bit better this afternoon. So, we are definitely going to get you guys a message. Gemini, we have a new tarot deck. It's um, my large tarot cards. I really like this tarot deck. I hope you guys like them. We're going to be using them today. Alright, Gemini. So, this is going to be um, your message um, for why I chose the karmic. We're going to take a look and see um, why your person chose the karmic. Um, for some of you guys, you and this person could be in separation, or um, maybe you guys were in separation, maybe you guys are together now, and they chose the karmic, um, maybe before you guys go, got back together. Like, you know where you are in this, but this is to see what the karmic energy that's playing a role between the two of you guys, alright? And what could be separating you guys, some of you guys could be on and off. So to make a long story short, that's what this reading is all about. All right, Jim. Now, you know the rules. You know how this goes, Gemini. I will be calling all the signs and energies. Remember, it could be your person's sign or energy that I see. Um, so keep in mind, it could be your person's sign or the energy that they're in. All right, guys, to make a long story short, Gemini, you could be connecting with the, um, with the Capricorn. All right, also, I could be picking up on the energy of you and your person, and the energy can go back and forth. So, Gemini, when I get really thin cards like this, I like to spread them out. All right, and we're just going to go ahead and pick. Oh, didn't I tell y'all? Didn't I say someone here is connecting with the Capricorn? Or you can have a Capricorn placement. All right, some of you guys might want to look at the Capricorn video on why they chose the karmic. So we have, um, I'm going to tell you right now, I am picking up on some spell work. Yeah, someone with the Taurus energy on the bottom of the deck. Um, someone could have also paid for some spell work. Yeah, we got Cancer as well. This could have been a woman. All right, Cancer is water energy, so that's here. All right, um, Taurus is earth energy, so it's Capricorn. So you could be um, connecting with the earth sign as well. All right. Uh, you could be a cross watcher. All right. I could be picking up the energy of you or your person or the energy could go back and forth. All right, let's jump into this. Now... Someone here could be paying for some kind of spell work. Um, this could be um, a Gemini or a Taurus doing this against um, you as well. Ooh. Or this could be a Cancer doing this to you, Gemini. Um, I believe... Let's see what's going on. Oh, Capricorn again, a Devil card. This is heavy. I'm here... Yeah, uh-uh. Someone here is doing some kind of love spell on you, Gemini. What is going on? What is this for Gemini? The devil clarifying the devil. That's pretty, um, Gemini. I don't know how long I'm going to be able to stay on this. Yep, tire moment. All right. Um, to keep you and your person separated. This could be some form of conflict magic as well to keep you and your person, like, fighting. Yeah. Oh, boy. There could be, like, three people doing this. All right. What is this? Oh, child. Yeah, to keep local came back out. To keep things upside down. All right, between, yeah, honey, there's a lot of snake. This could be a karmic that your masculine um was dealing with. Keep in mind, guys, that karmic is energy. Yeah. This is someone um they also had history, history with. Keep in mind that karmic is all energy, guys, okay? Um, here. Yeah, this is someone they used to talk to. Why is next? Ooh. For some of you guys, this is the baby's mom. Yeah, it is. And I, this, for some of you guys, this is the baby's mom. 
or this is your person's baby's mom and they could be doing this to keep you guys this, uh, um you guys separated so they could have chose their baby's mom or I, i'm getting past energy and this is coming over in your guys' situation now I feel like this is someone's baby's mom that's not over them yet. No, bull energy. Didn't I say Taurus is here? They still want to work on it. Yeah, Scorpio is also the Ten of Cups. And we have Aquarius here, which is all about communication. This person still wants to work on it. Yeah, this family, especially with the family tree. Why is this snake here? I'm sorry. Can I get something on this water, please? Why is water here? And then in Cancer, pop out early. That represents family. So they couldn't live with this person before or something like that. And for other you and for others of you, and I'm seeing Taurus here twice. And for others of you, they could have like like the back way I'm seeing this, they could have went back to this person because they have a family with no child in reverse, yeah. And it's not working. Yeah, it's not working. Yeah. I'm getting like a wave of energy. Like for some of you guys, this is past tense. This is why they went back to their baby's mom. And for some of you guys, they, this is why they could have, like, went to their baby's mom. What is this? Yeah, this emperor. Exactly. And it's not working. No, it's not. It's very toxic. And this is someone that they have a child with. For some of you guys, this is someone that they talked to as well in the past. Is also what I'm getting here. What is Taurus? What is Taurus? This is karma. Yeah, here we go. The Ten of Cups, the King of Cups, the Eight of Swords. This is the thing. This is the thing. This person had you in a, yeah, third party. They had you in a karmic cycle. Or they tried to get you involved in this karmic cycle. They were never over this person at that time. Yeah, Nine of Cups. And for some of you guys, they could have been talking to you guys at the same time here. Yeah, yeah. Seven of Wands in reverse, and you didn't know that. Let me do something specific on this. That's a lot of cards, guys. Wait a second. Spirit, can I get something specific? Red is specific. Maybe the, your um, Emperor's favorite color is red. Somebody's favorite color is red, and somebody got braids. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. Yeah, with this Queen of Pentacles. They could have. Um, for some of you guys, they were. They were talking to both of you guys at the same time. And for some of you guys, they could have been dating. Yeah, Three of Cups and an Ace of Wands. For a lot of you guys, this was just sexual based. This was sexual based. Yeah. We more than 20 principles. Yeah. Yeah, Three of Cups. Yeah. This is, yeah, Page of Swords, yeah. This is who they were lying to you and talking to, yeah, King of Wands. And they were having sex with both of you guys at the same time. Mercury, why is Mercury here? What is this? Yeah, they were in and out, eight of one, sideways. This person was in and out between you and this person. And for some of you guys, there's a baby here that you might not know about. Two of Pentacles in um, reverse. I can't make this up. And I feel like... This person could have felt like they were in love with yep, Queen of Swords. You became cold on them or your guard is now up. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, guys. Yeah, and the Queen of Swords and the Page of Swords, for some of you guys, this could be like your baby's dad. But they were talking. I feel like this person was in love with two people. Because I'm not going to lie. They, they feel like they have love for this other person, too. But they could connect to this other person different than they have with you. Like, this person could feel like, you know, at that time, they they connected with this person this way and you that way. So, you know, they were in love with, in their mind, they were, they had two women and they, like, they couldn't choose. But something became snakeish here. What is that? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yep. Yeah. And now, yeah, here it is. Here it is. And now they got to pay out. They had a baby. And for some of you guys, you don't know this. Yep, they had a baby with that person. 
Yeah, the Queen and the King of Pentacles is a good pair in the Three of Cups. And for some of you guys, like, you know where you are in this. This could be, like, you. Maybe you didn't know you were the third party and you found out. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like when you did, some of you guys might have walked away. All right. But this is what this was. They were talking to both of you guys, and I feel like this baby came. Let's pull some more energy. Yeah. So, I don't know if it was like you guys. And then, like, they had to, had a baby with someone else. And you found out, or you're just someone else and found out they had someone. Yeah. Yeah, and that's how this, this is why it ended. Um, with the World Court, or you ended it, yep, with this King of Cups. Um, this person still thinks about you a lot. Um, this person could even think about reaching out to you. Everything you say or do, they think about you. I'm hearing that song. All I do, all I do is think of you. This person's constantly thinking of you. It's like they're obsessed. Alright, ooh. Hold on, guys. But someone here, like, I see, like, you walked away from this shit, like, you knew. Yeah, you knew there was some sneaky shit going on in Seven of Swords. I can't make this shit up. Aquarius energy. Like you figured, yep, and you caught judgment. And you caught judgment. Because you figured out like something was wrong here. Yeah. Yeah, yep, and here go that baby. Yeah. Yeah. They were trying to hold on to... For some of you guys, they were trying to hold on to you and this person at the same time. Yep, Eight of Swords. They were trying to keep you stuck. The Eight of Swords is here twice. And they weren't They weren't telling you that. Yeah. It's also what I'm getting here. Can I get more on this um, judgment? Why is the judgment here? For some of you guys, they could... Um, Someone here could, like, have to pay child support. Like, them and this karmic could have already broken up. Or on the verge to breaking up. Alright, someone here is definitely in spiritual court, the moon court. Yeah, yep, and lovers. I'm telling you, I can't make this shit up. This is spiritual court. The lovers in the moon court, they're secretly, yeah, honey, yep. Because of, the, because of what they did to you. This person's in secret, yep, nine of cups. Because they were, they, they knew, this person knew they were wrong and they knew exactly what they were doing. And for some of you guys, they knew they were stringing you along. Because for some of you guys, they already had a relationship. And for some of you guys, this could be, um, Gemini, lo ding ding, confirmation from the universe. This could be them, like, having issues at home and shit. And, like, you know, you know how you hear how people have issues at home and they go find someone or find someone else to talk to to entertain them. And this whole time they have a family and shit. For some of you guys, they have a baby on the way they didn't tell you. They didn't expect for you and them to, like, get along. This snake is here twice and the devil card came out twice. Tell me more about the snake card. Like, they didn't plan to get feelings for you. No, they didn't. And then once they did, they didn't know how to tell you that they had a baby on the way. You won't judge I told you. This is why. Because of their snake-ass behavior. They're hermit. This person is learning a spiritual lesson. Yep. Magic and the emperor. The empress. Yeah. And then I tell you magic. Yeah. This person had you under some kind of... Con this was... I said conflict magic. For some of you guys, this was um, some kind of verbal spell here. Making you think something, but it's, it's some, it was something else. Like this person knew the whole time they really couldn't. Ding, ding. Confirmation from the universe. This person knew the whole time they could only give you but so much. The sun card. They had you thinking it was going to be more than what it was. It, it, it never was going to be that. What is this? Yeah, the four cuts. But see, in the process, they played themselves because they fell in love with you. 
Yeah, page of one. And now this person wants to come towards you to two of cups. Yeah, but see, they have this secret that they're not telling you, the high priestess. For some of you guys, this person could, yep, um, five of pentacles. This person could also be married. Tell me more about that. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. And for some of you guys, you could have felt this like, like when they were home, they could have like blocked you. Or maybe there were certain times that you couldn't get in touch with this person because they were at home. Yeah, five of pentacles. Yeah, four of pentacles. Like you couldn't get a hold of this person. I can't make this up. Six of ones on the bottom of the deck. Like you couldn't reach out to this person because... And this person ended up... But see, the thing about it is, see, this is why karma is a just best served cold. Because now this person's in spiritual court about you because they caught feelings. And now they feel bad. They feel bad. What is the Ace of Wands? Yep, the Nine of Swords. I keep hearing that song, All I Do Is Think Of You. Yep, the King of Pentacles. All they do is this person is up thinking about you. This person can't sleep. Someone here can't sleep about playing with you. God is dealing with them. Yep, page of pentacles, yeah, intemperance. Yeah, this person is in their feelings, emotion, very emotional. Someone here cries at night as well. Give me more than that, sword. Yep, the star card, yeah. This person, because they need your healing. Someone here also, yep, the queen of wands. Also, this person sends you a lot of sexual energy at night. Also, someone here... They're not happily, they're not happy in their marriage. Give me something on this Queen of Pentacles specifically. Thank you, Spirit. Yep, five of ones in reverse. I can't make this shit up. They're not happy. They're not happy in their marriage. That's the truth. Yeah. Yep, and the Three of Cups. Yep. That's why they started talking to you in the first place, King of Swords. I can't make this shit up. Look, and the High Priest is in reverse. And like I said... Okay, and like I said, thank you, Spirit. Look, Gemini, this is what this is. This person is married, or this person has a long, committed relationship. When things are not going well, or they fight, this person cheats. And at the same time, they 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 hold on to their marriage or their long-term relationship. But they met you, Four of Pentacles, and they want to hold on to you. This person did not expect Capricorn energy again there. This person did not expect to catch feelings for you. That's what this is. They did not expect the ding ding, four of pentacles, confirmation from the universe. I'm telling you. Well, I, yep, eight of wands. I'm telling you. And this person wants to communicate with you. This person wants to, yep, it's a shrimp card. This person is even thinking about, yo. Gemini, now your reading is crazy. This, this person said, think about leaving this unhappy marriage. You broke this curse. This this, this is a curse. Yeah, that's why the devil popped out here twice. And I was talking about magic. This is a generational curse. Uh, uh, it is. Mm -hmm. It's a mental spell, a mind spell. This is someone who believes that they have to stay for the, the luck of the children. Or their family. You see the family tree. You see the family tree. The stork, the child, and the koi fish. Oh, they believe in order to make this home work, you have to stay in this marriage. There's kids involved. There's this involved. There's that involved. You know that's why we do it for the kids. They could be listening to their family as well. Here, cause Scorpio popped out with um, yeah, with the water energy cancer representing home. Yeah, about why they should stay. This in 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 actuality, that's the reason why they should leave because this house will never be a home. It will just be a house, and that's why it's upside down. They'll be teaching their children to stay in relationships and families that homes would look like this. Someone's child could be an Aries as well. And that's what this curse is. It's a mind curse. So they stay. 
this person is not happy in this marriage. They haven't been happy in this marriage for some time now. Yeah. And for some of you guys, this 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 marriage could have been going on for like four years. Four four to six years. So they could have already been married for like two years before they met you. Yeah. And you and, and you shine you, you everything you brought color to their world. This person's world was black and white and was dumb when they met you. You brought color. I hear that song, I see your true color shining. Yeah. You brought colors to this person, to a one, and that's why they can't stop thinking about you. This is what this person wants. Yeah. That's exactly what's happening here. Let's step up the tea a little bit. Yeah, this person thinks your beauty, your fashion, they like your beauty, they like your makeup, they like the way you wear your clothes. I'm hearing even jewelry when I touch this card. Some of you guys can even work in the beauty or fashion industry. Yeah, backstab and reverse. This person also sees you as a total opposite of the person they're married to or in this relationship with. You're like a breath of fresh air to this person. They're in love with you. Look, I can't make this shit up. I can't make this shit up, Gemini. I want to be with you. This person wants to be with you. Okay. I mean, this person is heavily thinking about you at night. Messages for Gemini. I get messages for Gemini. Messages for Gemini. Messages for Gemini. Messages for Gemini. Ooh. You could be definitely dealing with an air sign, Gemini. You showed up in your um, reading. Or for some of you guys, you could be dealing with the air sign as well. This person is in love with you. Now, this is what I will say, um, Gemini. You might need to be careful because this person could want to get you pregnant on purpose. Yes, that's here. And why I'm saying that? Because they want you stuck with them. But that's unfair to you because this person needs to be... I'm hearing balls, so they need to... Excuse me, guys. There I go burping, channeling y'all's energy. They need to drop their nuts. Ding, ding. Confirmation from the universe and be honest. If they ain't happy in a relationship, it's their responsibility to get their ass out the right way if they really want to be with you instead of trying to put you in a third party. That's why they, they're choosing this karmic because they need to man up. They might have saw their mom settle or their father settle for partners that is unhappy, but they stake for the kids. Like the kids don't know. The kids be the first pe people, the first people to know. I can't even say it right. The kids always know. They, they the first two to know. Two kids, maybe this person got two kids. But the kids is always the first to know. You can't hide shit from your kids. That's why you need to teach them to stand up. That's this person's problem. And their true happiness is with you. And look, I'm divorced. That's, this person could even been divorced for some of you guys because the king and the queen of swords came out. Okay. All right, I'm going to end out in one second. So that's confirmation for some of you guys. This person will be getting a divorce or maybe already is divorced. Wait a minute, guys. I can't control it. I got a new son. I can't work a child. Okay. So for, so, and, and that's good. And if for others of you guys, this person is getting a divorce because they're in an unhappy marriage. Maybe they're, they don't know how you would feel. Maybe they weren't honest. At, there's something energy here where this person wasn't honest with you at first about what was going on in their life or why they stayed in this fucked up marriage. And another reason is they didn't want you to know how fucked up this marriage was. Spell work. Didn't I tell you? This is a generational curse. Spell work is here. Also, they could have been with the karmic that did it, it kept them under some... It's like mental spell work for me. Okay. Yeah, that beauty fashion court came back out block is here. Okay, you could have blocked this person. Oh, we have famous celebrity. So someone here could be a public figure. They could be well known. We have a paramedic police. Okay, um, here as well. 
someone could be a paramedic or a police officer. Someone here, yeah, this person likes your style. Stiletto shaped coffin. They like your nails. They like your fashion. They like your jewelry. All right. Let's see what else. Someone here can has a van or can drive a van for work. Baby's mom. This person wants to make you the mother or the father of their child. Masculine or feminine energy. What else? Yeah, I, yeah, I told you. Someone here, um, they're hiding from you because they're scared of you. I feel like this person is also scared of you knowing everything they've been through with this karmic. Okay, what else? The whore of Babylon. Because this karmic was a whore. Someone is a whore. I regret it and I'm in my feelings. Yeah. And for some of you guys, they, 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 they were unfaithful. I feel like this person has a tendency to sleep around, but they kept feelings for you because they haven't been happy in this marriage for so long. And shit, I'm not going to lie, maybe they have been a little horse, little hoe, instead of just leaving this goddamn relationship. They have secrets on me, that's why I stay. Boom. And that's why confirmation of why your person could have stayed in this relationship. Alright? Let's grab some of these cards. Almighty, beautiful universe and the Holy Spirit. Oh, God. Hold on one second. Yeah. You missed someone? Okay. Shallow grave. So you're missing this person too. Little guy is but where will it lead you? Yeah, see this person is guided towards you three. Three's about coming together. Guy is but where but where will it lead you? But they're scared to show you everything. They're scared to tell you everything because they're scared that you'll walk away. Or you will be upset. Yeah, please don't lose hope. This person don't want you to lose hope and they're hoping over time you can forgive them. Alright, that's that's just what this is, Gemini. I'm sorry, my daughter came downstairs, guys, so I got a little bit distracted there. But that's what's happening. Let's pull you um some more Oracle message, Gemini, and that will be the reading. All right, let's see. For Gemini. Okay. Yeah, see, so Unicorn, um, Serendipity, Invite, in, in Reverse. Yeah, this, this person wants to come towards you, but this, this person's nervous. Because this person really loves you. You're the real deal. You're the real deal. Okay. And now they see. Also they val they see the value in you guys' relationship. And how it's important. Not to. This person needs to get their friends, their family, and everybody else out their ear. And go about what they feel. Because with you they have true love. Or they're always going to be unhappy in this relationship. We have gratitude in reverse. Yeah, like I said, they're always going to be unhappy in this relationship. Yeah, and they and it won't be blessed. Because this is a cycle that this person's supposed to break. It's a curse. It's a karmic energy. They were supposed to break it. This energy will keep. They're going to teach their kids to do it. Their kids' kids will do it. So keep recycling this energy so someone learns this lesson. So that's why you have to be careful with karmic energy and curses. Okay, Gemini, I love you so much. I'm going to have to end it there. My daughter does need me. Um, I was reading. I got a little distracted at the end. But um, I feel like this message is clear as day. I hope um, this helped you out more ways than one. Look what came back out. This person definitely wants... Be careful now because this person got some trickery. They do. They want you bad. All right, Gemini. So I hope this helped you out more ways than one. Guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to the channel. Hit the bell. Hit all. Make sure you get all content, Gemini. Um, and I will catch you next time. Love you guys. Ashe.